replacing and installing it with a Minn Kota MKR-27 main disconnect breaker for Minn Kota trolling motor. Hey guys, thanks for watching One Body Fishing. Today we're replacing our main disconnect for our trolling motor battery. This right here is bad. And we're going to be replacing and installing it with a Minn Kota MKR-27 main disconnect breaker for our Minn Kota trolling motor. All right, we've got our wire stripped back, ready for our new terminal. We've got our heat shrink installed. We'll put a little dielectric on and we'll be ready to go. Got our terminal on, ready to crimp it down. Crimp it to it clicks. All right, we're almost good to go. We've got our termination complete. Ready to hook it up to our breaker. This heat shrink will give us that added protection against that salt water air. Okay, we've got a heat shrink. Now we're ready to terminate. All right. All right, we've got our breaker installed. You guys pay slow attention when you're installing. One says battery side, another one says load side. So always make sure you terminate correctly. We've got our 60 amp breaker in. We'll go ahead and close her in. We should have power to our trolling motor now. Okay, final test. Let's test our voltage right here on our battery. Oh, look at there, we've got voltage. All right, let's see if the power works. Thank you, Lord, we've got power. Hey guys, welcome back to One Body Fishing. Today we're in 1 Corinthians 10, 31. It says, therefore, whatever you do, whether you eat or drink, whatever you do, glorify the Lord God. Hey, I hope today uh, we can glorify God and no matter what we do, whether it's rebuilding a trolling motor or whether it's replacing a breaker like we did for our disconnect, whatever you do, let's glorify the Lord. Thanks for watching One Body Fishing. Hopefully next time we'll see you on the water.